Welcome to Nanoplasma Family. It is a common platform for researchers to share, discuss and implement the cutting edge research ideas in almost all areas of science and engineering. Bismillah Rahman Rahim. With the Science Wisdom series on Nanoplasma Family, I am Dr. Shazi Shikrullah. We are having Dr. Muhammad Yasin Naz, uh, fourth expert opinion. This week we received a very hot question. Can Moon be a laboratory for the testing the nuclear weapons? Different countries time to time test nuclear weapons on the earth. Most of us know that the nuclear explosions adversely affect the human health and then primarily due to air loss, thermal radiations, initial nuclear radiation and residual nuclear radiations or fallout. So to protect the land and human, can we use moon as a testing place for the nuclear weapons? Thank you very much. To my opinion, it is possible. In 1950s, the American Air Force decided to explore a nuclear device on the surface of the moon. But due to some reasons, higher authorities turned on the decision. But they can uh, do in the future. What could be immediate effect on the new testing on the moon? Uh, American physicist who was working on this project said that if an ordinary nuclear device is exploded on the surface of the moon, it doesn't affect too much to the moon's environment and its orbit. But if the plan is bigger uh, and we have enough nuclear arsenal to explode on the moon's surface, uh, then surely it can affect the moon environment and can push the moon out of its orbit. So, how much the moon can shift out of its orbit? Well, it depends on the point where nuclear device to be exploded and what amount of the energy it can produce. Uh, till today, the world doesn't have enough nuclear arsenal energy uh, to produce sufficient energy to shift the moon out of its orbit. Uh, for example, the most powerful nuclear device ever tested by Russia can produce uh, 50 megatons of energy. Uh, till today, the world arsenal, nuclear arsenal, including Russia, United States, uh, United King Kingdom, China, Pakistan, India, North Korea, and Israel are not sufficient to produce enough nuclear energy to disturb the moon environment. For example, the present world arsenal can produce 7,000 of megatons of the energy and to shift the moon out of its orbit, the energy, the required energy is uh, somewhere between uh, 10 billion megatons to 10 trillion megatons. It shows that this required energy is much, much higher than the current capability of the world. And even in coming few centuries, it is not possible to gain such uh, capability to disturb the moon's surface. So what is the future con consequences of this shift? Interestingly, the moon by itself is moving away from the earth without any human intervention. Every year, the moon is shifting three to four centimeters away from the earth. <clears throat> and the moon gravitation force exerts the pull and drag force on a portion of the water on the earth by changing it into purges on both ends of the earth. These purges couldn't settle back at their same position and change into the cyclones. These cyclones uh, move towards the moon and adds uh, kinetic energy to the moon. So due to increase in kinetic energy, the moon moves away from the earth. That's why I say it's shifting three to four centimeter away from the earth every year. Uh, in short term, this shift does not have any drastic effect on the moon and earth environment but in the long term it can change the total behavior of the moon 
at the same time the earth will also take this effect although the earth is a bigger planet it will not shift from its orbit but it can get destabilized and to get back its stability it can teeter on its axis like a woman wearing heels when it loses its balance so it it vibrates about its mean position to keep its balance or a magician moving on a rope when it loses its balance so it's it's move left and right to keep its balance so due to this balance shift uh the seasons can change some seasons can disappear forever some seasons can get for long and also it is possible that the earth can topple over just like the uranus who toppled over its axis and start orbiting the moon on its side thank you very much and thank you so much doctor for answering us such a hot questions we received from the nano family channel thank you so much